Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. We're back to Return of the Overdin tonight. <clears throat> Last time, we identified nine more fates, uh, completed Chapter 2, and got, I think, a little bit closer on a few more. Um, so let's keep, let's keep going. Let's keep going. 15 out of 60, I believe. So we're a quarter of the way there. Um, we'll see if we decide to, to push for all 60. It's really going to depend. It's really going to depend. So let's let's take a look at our let's take a look at our notebook here. What do we got to do? We completed chapter two in its entirety, I believe, right? Yeah, because it was the it was the cow and the two dudes who who died of the sickness, um, and that's it. So maybe we can do chapter three. We already did uh, <clears throat> Nunzio Pasqua there. He was stabbed, and uh, Oxing Lao was shot for the murder of Nunzio or whatever. Not great. Not great. Things did not work out so well for uh, for either of those two. Um, okay, we're probably not going to get that one too easily. Uh, soul, spirit, vital, blah, 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 blah. Okay, right, right. And then there was chapter four, which was all <clears throat> out in the boats and such. Um, that was kind of a pain to, to, to go through, but we're going to try our best. We're going to try our best. Um, so, um, maybe we can try, we can, maybe we can start with some of those and see if our, our memory from last time is holding up, and it probably is not, but, you know, it's, it's a good try anyway. So, uh, let's see, where was that pile of corpses? <clears throat> from the boat, over here, right? Yeah. Over here, so, uh, this is interesting. I'm pretty sure... One of these, okay, I think this dude took a spear in the chest, right? And then one of these dudes, I think, drowned. But we'll we'll find out, we'll find out. Hey, Omega Weapon, how you doing? Good to see you. All right, chapter five, or part five of chapter whatever this is. Oh, right, that's the dude who burned to death. Um, and then Nichols got shot later, I think, right? <clears throat> then a couple others just fucking, I guess, went overboard. And or were speared, and or whatever. Um, but yeah, this isn't gonna... This isn't gonna give us any uh, <clears throat> new clues being here, because we've already kind of solved everything in this particular section of it. So let's back up one more to part four, right? Yeah. Oh, this was the O'Hanigan or whatever. O'Hagan? Right? No, uh, O'Hagan was uh, <clears throat> the part before that, right? Um, but I still don't know, like, who these people are, do I? Or are they saying I can identify? I can identify them, but who the f... Who the fuck? Um... Did we ever find out what happened to this dude? Did, did he take a spear in the chest at some point? No, we've got the the chest spear guy here. <clears throat> chest spear guy was here. Uh, neck spear guy. Oh, is that the neck spear guy? Oh yeah, that looks like a a chunk of a spear in his neck. So, um, or a knife. That could be a knife too. Oh, maybe it was this dude who finally got a hold of a knife or something. He's like, fuck you. I'm gonna knife you and then I'm gonna... I don't know what he's doing here. He's digging around in the box, but I don't know, like, what exactly he's doing. I think he got lit on fire by that thing. Okay. So what what happened to next spear guy? Oh, there's, yeah, Nichols being a little shit. There's next spear guy. All right. <clears throat> And I guess the other couple, uh, must have drowned? So let's see what we've got. We've got dude digging in box, cowardly ass nickels, uh, chest spear over there, neck spear here, and was there one more over here, right? Ah, knife in neck. Um, I'm, like, my guess is that this dude did it, right? Like, the hardest part of this is gonna be... Um, who the fuck he is. So, he got, uh, knifed. Oh, there is actually a knife. Uh, by, uh, what's his nuts here? Um, do -do 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 -do. 
Uh, where's that list? Here. Uh, by Bang, right? Yeah. <clears throat> and I don't know who he is, but he's been in a lot of things, hasn't he? Oh, he's been in five memories. All right, so we'll, we'll, uh, we'll do that eventually. Is that O'Hagan, do you think? No, no. Oh, yeah. No, no, he was talking to O'Hagan. That's right. We were trying to figure out who the fuck O'Hagan was last time. And I don't know exactly who O'Hagan would have been. Still breathing. Like, how how would anybody still be breathing? Like, I don't... No. That's not O'Hagan. That doesn't look like an O'Hagan to me, does it? No, certainly not. Uh... <clears throat> And then this was, was this chest spear or neck spear? I think that was neck spear, yeah? Yeah. There's no way that's O'Hagan. But, uh, speared by a terrible beast, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, where was chest spear? Chest spear was here. Just want to make sure we noted these, uh, different ones. Okay, speared by a terrible beast. Hmm, okay, well... Then let us uh, back up another part here to part three, yeah? Mm. Oh, Agus, you're still breathing? Can you roll? <clears throat> Nichols, sir, shoot them for God's sake! Maybe that was O'Hagan, because he was the one that ate it right here, right? <clears throat> oh yeah, he definitely took a knife to the to the throat from uh, good old Bang here, right? Yeah. So maybe this was O'Hagan. Maybe O'Hagan took the knife to the throat. No, no, no. He was talking to O'Hagan. That's right. Shit. Uh... Then it must have been... Th this must have been O'Hagan then. Because fucking... He's the only one who could have theoretically hurt him. Right? Because there's no way. There's no way. Like, anybody else heard. And this dude was unaccounted for in later parts, so... I'm gonna guess he drowned. He must have drowned, right? Was drowned by an unknown attacker. No. Well... I mean, he wasn't really, was he? It's that kind of... What's that floating next to him? Oh, it's a pipe. How the heck could you be smoking a pipe out on the open seas? That seems really bad. Seems like a bad idea. You'd want to have, like, the entirety of your lung capacity available to you <clears throat> whilst you're dealing with this. Okay, well, that can't be okay. Oh, no, he was being pulled down. Okay, I didn't notice that little... That little... Little sea hand there. Pulling him in, so, okay. Almost certainly drowned by a beast. Um, and I don't know who he is. That can't be O'Hagan, though. Would that be O'Hagan? No. Um, goes back to this, right? Like, because here's who ate it in this part, right? And I think he, he must have been the one who was talking here, right? Because he's got the little X next to his thing. Yeah. But I, I, I think if he was getting the throat stabbed out of him, or sliced out of him, or whatever, he wouldn't be sounding nearly as good as he was. And Nichols definitely wasn't doing any talking. Probably wouldn't have heard him talking, right? Hmm. All right. Well, well, we'll leave that. I still don't know who O'Hagan is here, so let's keep on, <clears throat> keep on keeping on here. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, 
Lower on myself, yada yada yada. Nichols is doing his thing. I got Bang there. Slim. Probably Bang again. <clears throat> And then whoever was saying, oh, blah, 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 they say strange things about monsters. That must have been this dude, because he was the only one to, to eat it here, right? Yeah, and then he eats it soon after, because that's definitely his voice. But how... I shut it up. Here's I shut it up, dude. But he didn't eat it. He kind of just disappeared. Or was he, or did he make it back? No, I think Nichols is the only one that made it back, right? Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, Nichols is there. Those two there. He ate it. Right, he was stabbed by Bang. Or sliced, whatever. <clears throat> and then... He took a spear to the chest. What happened to this guy? We know what happened to him? No. Like, he disappeared. He just, like, straight up. Oh. We don't know if he's alive, though. Hmm. Did he appear in part two? I think we skipped part two. Alright. <clears throat> oh, right. You're right. Yeah, because he, then he pulled up alongside the Oberdin and then he got shot <laughs> by one of the other guards, which is amazing. Which is pretty good, actually. So, did he. Edward Nichols. Yeah, okay. He's the one that got shot. There's Miss Lim. There's uh, Bang, right? Yeah. He burned to death. And I don't think anybody else. Yeah, we didn't find anybody else. So it, it hmm. Hmm. Alright, let's see if we can backtrack to part two then, I suppose, right? Unless he's is he among the dead here, the dude we're thinking of? No. No. Spear in chest, knife in throat, uh, spear in cheek, Nichols, Miss Lim, unfortunately, slashed throat. Other dude disappeared. Or was other dude pulled overboard? No. We're, we're missing somebody. We're missing somebody here. Uh, this is part four? Yeah. I'm gonna go back to... Oops, not there. I'll go back to maybe part three. We don't even have him in this chapter. That's kind of strange. Oh, yeah, here, 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 here. Two wayward souls disappeared during the events of this chapter. Their fates are cataloged here. Uh... Yeah. I guess we didn't explicitly see them die, so maybe he didn't drown? Maybe he drowned. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. We don't have enough info to solve this. Well, I mean... The game thinks we have enough info to solve this, but... Uh, I am thoroughly less confident than that. Hmm. That might change as we uh, consume more of our investigator's juice here. So, uh, so chapter four is probably out for now. Uh, who are these folks here? 
This is chapter five. Okay. We got spiked. We got spiked. Uh, we got him. He got slapped in the face real hard. Uh, that guy got crushed by something they were carrying down, right? Charles, did Charles go? No, we don't even know if this was Charles. Or at least it's not locked in yet. How many do we have kind of ready here? Uh, crew. We've only got the one, yeah? Yeah, so we're gonna need to fill out two more to, to get another lock. Unfortunate. Unfortunate, unfortunate. Uh, alright. I think the best chance we have right now is the dude that took a bullet through the wall, through one of the beasts. So let's go back to that one. We need to get on the outside of this, I think, right? I think it was, no, oh, not this direction. I think it was this deck, yeah? Yeah, it must have been. Uh, it wasn't this guy, because he, ooh, man, yeah, that guy ate it pretty bad. He was pinned to the wall or something, right? Yeah, here. Here we go. Okay. Okay, yeah, because he got... Didn't he take a spike or something, then he went all the way the fuck around? There. And then he eventually got shot by this guy. Like, like, great aim. Let's be honest, like a fucking double kill there. Nice job. But, uh, unfortunately one of them was friendly fire. Uh, can I get back in there to actually take a peek at him, or... Is that gonna be just like, nah, you can't do that. Ah, yeah, you can't let me go back around there, can they? Oh, did the doc eat it here too? No, but that is the doc, or the surgeon, rather. Right? I just need to get a clear enough shot at that dude's face to be like, oh yeah, he did it. I mean, we know he did it, but who is he? Oh, come on. Let me just use my fancy time binoculars to see a little bit further there. Getting fatally wounded by some spider monster, crawling to safety, and then getting wallbangers sent to in the other time. <laughs> right? Like, wow, yeah, that is some really bad luck. But, I mean, I suppose it's better than bleeding out? Slowly? Well, more slowly? I don't know. Like, it, it's, it's hard to even- oh, who's this guy? Do we know who this guy is? I think we know who that guy is, right? No, he was shot by the gun, though. Oh, that's a mirror. Okay. Looks like he was handing out weaponry. Or no, where the fuck? Well, where am I, actually? Where am I? Eh. Eh. On the ship. A gunner's store. Okay. So, yeah, he was handing out wapons. <laughs> okay, so I don't think I can identify that guy without going back maybe one part so I can get back inside. But let's see. He'll be at the gunner's store. Do we have... Maybe he's the gunner's mate? Maybe that's good old Olus? Uh, I mean, he's kind of standing nearby. Okay, yeah, so there's the, there's the gunner, right? That could be the gunner's mate, honestly. It's observing 
three bad shots and one slightly better shot. Uh, yeah, where else was he? Where else was he? So maybe we check out dude spiked to wall and we can identify the other one in that section. Yeah, part six rather than part seven, yeah. Ooh, yeah, that's not great. <laughs> that's not a great amount of sounds, is it? Oh, but this was after the fight. Ah, yeah. We're not gonna be able to do this here anyway. But there's old Olus, yeah? Or who we think is Olus. Okay, yeah. It's not quite the section we wanted to be in. Alright, so... Maybe one of these two, because they were kind of fighting with it? Yeah, there we go. I think. Ooh, yeah, that doesn't sound good. <laughs> that doesn't sound good at all. And I think this was- was this the dude that was crawling away? I think this is the dude that was crawling away, yeah. Uh, eh. Or no. Is that not the one I had bookmarked? Wait, what the hell? Uh. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay, so. Part seven, uh, part four, five, six, seven. Okay, this is the dude I've got bookmarked. That's him. That's him right there. That's the man officer. I swear it was him. Uh, okay, so he ate it over there. Um, yeah, I think I'm still like one part two. Good, good thinking, throwing a Molotov. Come just one part too far this way still. Or no, here, here's our, here's our dude handing out the guns and shit. That looks like this guy then, the dude who shot him. Fuck that is though. Damn, that one's not. Uh... <sighs> that is not the one I was hoping it would be. So we got nothing on him. Not even that he died. Who are you? Okay, here's here's the gunner himself, right? I think. Yeah. And eventually this dude was handed shit out too. Like what the hmm. Who are you? Oh, no. There's What the what are you doing here, buddy? What are you doing? What was your plan? Trying to hold it closed or push it open? Or maybe you just tripped like an idiot. You probably just tripped like an idiot. Okay. 
Alright, is that guy considered decapitated yet? Or did he wait till next part to eat it? I said he was strangled. One of these dudes definitely ended up decapitated, though. I think. Let's see if we can identify that one. Um, I thought it's either one of these two, right? Yeah, here. Uh, which one of you has still got a head on your shoulders? Either of you? This one definitely looks like his head is gone. Totally gone. This one maybe has got a little connection yet. Oh, no, but he, uh, he was strangled, huh? Okay. What about you? Oh, no, that one's you. What about you? Oh, wait. No. Target this one. Alright, fuck it. Let's go. Oh, this was for both of them here. Okay. Part four. And this guy. Okay, so... Was this the one totally missing his head? Must have been, right? Ugh. Ah. <laughs> that didn't sound like a strangle. That sounded like a... a neck severing. Ouch. I still don't know who he is. It's also a three triangle one. What about you? What about the dude with the Molotov? Do we know anything about him? Oh, he got burned eventually, huh? Yeah. Womp. You, yeah. A satisfying crunch and crack? Yeah. That's what happens when it's on the other end, huh? And then this is the dude that got spiked in the chest, crawled a goodly amount of distance, and then got shot, right? Yeah. I don't know anything about him, either. Book and the Pokemon watch together enough information to deduce their identity. Study relationships, appearances, and activities, yada yada yada, individual conversation logs. Includes about names, relationships, appearances, and roles, yada yada yada. Yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah, we already knew all that. Hmm. I think we already ID'd this was the butcher, yeah, and he got toasted at some point. Yeah, he got spiked by a terrible beast. In the next part, or the part after. What do we know about you? Anything? Nope. He's probably a midshipman, though. If they, if they're dressed in sort of in uniform, he's probably a midshipman. That seems like a pretty reasonable assumption. Seems like the other midshipman. Hmm. Okay. There's too much going on in this scene. I can't... I can't do anything about it. What about this? Is this the dude we've been trying to ID forever? No. That guy we know about. Oh, this guy's brave. Do we know what happened to him? Do we know who he is? We don't know who he is. We think he's probably one of the other mates, based on his fancy hat, but we don't know which one. And do we know what happened to him? We, we, we get, he got clubbed. He got clubbed. He went clubbing. Uh, and got clubbed. 
Anything else happen here? Ooh, this guy's bold. He don't need no body armor. He's just going in. Good for him. You know who this guy is? Carpenter. Yeah. He's been, oh, no. He hasn't been locked in yet. But we think he's the carpenter. Based on where he was. What do we know about you? Nothing. Doesn't own a shirt. But I can respect it. Hmm. Yeah, we don't know what happened to him either. Hmm. Let's go back, or forward, depending on your understanding of time, uh, to Chapter 9. I want to see who was uh, getting on them lifeboats. Where's the door out of here? Probably down below. the door. Come on, let me <laughs> let me out of this hellscape. Where the heck is the door? There it is. Okay. So I'm looking for like a quick, easy win here. I think we can go back up to the lifeboats and ID a few. Uh, so I think it's going to be in this chapter, right? Chapter 9. Okay. Where was the ship in this chapter? Interesting. So they got turned around somewhere in there. Between the Azores and Madeira? Hmm. Okay. Okay. We can, we can make that work. Uh, chapter 9. Now, which of y'all actually got the fuck out of here? Oops. Damn. Uh, chapter 9. I think the two ladies escaped. One of them got a kill before they escaped, too. So, good on them. Uh, here. Okay. Uh, what was the name of that other place? Madeira or whatever? That's not on this list. So, Azores... And passengers, passengers. Emily Jackson and Miss Jane Bird. I'm just going to go from the top. And just in case, we'll take a look at some other things. If we can brute force this one, that'd be okay. Okay, it didn't do the little bub up thing, and congrats, you got three more, so that's probably not right. But, why don't we just flip them around?
No? No. <laughs> Damn. That would have been too easy, wouldn't it? Okay. We know they're passengers, though. Like, that's pretty clear to me. The surgeon? Did the surgeon not eat it? The surgeon got to the lifeboat? Nice. Good for him. Good for him. But... Let them go. Right, that's the surgeon there, yeah? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> okay. This looks like the dude that came back from, uh... No, maybe it's just because he's got a, like, a, a beard and whatever. No, here was the dude who went out on the, on the boats before, yeah? This is the other guy, okay. Hmm. Unless all three of them made it to the Ace Course. Uh, what's the... What's the ship's heading during all of this? Yeah, it got kind of turned around. I figured the Azores would have been the closest they could get, but who among them could probably do navigation? Certainly not me. Hmm. Unless all three of them made it to the Azores. Be willing to give that a try at brute forcing, you know? <laughs> Worth a shot. Worth a shot. I have a feeling like these two are probably on the firing line memory and one other, I guess. So let's see. What else do you got here? No, they were present when uh, what's her face got crushed by the rigging. Hmm. 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 Well, what about the other one? Oh, that's the one we were looking at. Alright, what about the other one? <laughs> Same three. <sighs> hmm. I feel like maybe we're missing a bit of info here.
Let's go and do some exploring. We'll get some more info from some exploration. Yeah, this is where Abigail was, right? There wasn't anything else weird about these passenger cabins, though. Pretty roomy, considering. Like, not bad. You know, let's see here. Where was, uh, where's our first sighting of Idiot McGee? There. Captain! Open the door! Kick it in! Ah! Bless me, British and Hey, hey, Yeah, William Hoscutt ate a fucking bullet in the chest. Way to go, idiot. That's right, because when he ate it super hard in part two, which is awesome. So he must have. Well, no. My headcanon is that he kicked the door open, staggered this dude back like four or five feet, and then took a step back and just BAM. Good shot, by the way, Cap. Good shot. Damn. Dead center. Center mass. From... This is a good ten foot. Ten feet away. Good aim. I think that's what I wanted to see, but... That's right. And this dude got the bright idea to cl climb around the back, right? And then he got toasted anyway, so... Good for him. Good for him. Alright, well, that's not the one I wanted to see. I wanted to see the one in the cat's quarters here. Because that's where this idiot ate it. I think, right? Yeah. Where are they? Must be in here someplace. <laughs> They're at the bottom of the sea. That's a lie. I want to hear it. I want to hear it. Oh, was that it? Oh, that was a little bit less juicy than I wanted it to be. Damn. I wanted to hear a nice clean cut. And then maybe some gurgling? That would have been satisfying. But no, that was kind of, kind of weak. Anticlimactic. Got a gosh dang clue who this guy is. 
Hmm. We know this was the cap, right? Yeah. It wasn't one of the higher ups. It's got kind of a plain shirt on him. There we go. There's the There's the burbling I was hoping for. I don't know who that was. That's a hell of a stretch to make, when you just took a knife to the... looks too high to be a kidney. Like, to the liver or something? To then just whip around... fucking... pacha, Right to the forehead. Amazing. Head on, apply directly to the forehead. <laughs> okay, that didn't help, but that was fun. It was fun to review. Passenger cannons. Huh. Okay, well. Where's the cat? Okay, so we've got a, we've got a name. Main deck. Uh, that was her that got crushed by the rigging. Yeah. Martin? I guess he's the only one kind of within earshot. These two are busy. They are busy and they ain't in no mood for talking. So, if we look, he, and he was the one with one of the fancy hats, yeah? So he's probably one of the mates. Means oops. Eh. Martin. Oops. Martin. 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 Who are you? Third mate. Martin Perot. That is who I deem you to be. Which means other dude with hat that we do not know is the other mate. John Davies. Here you go, John. There is your... There is your name. 
okay. Well, that's good. That's good. That's something. Do we know what happened to him? We don't know what happened to him. What was the last thing that he was in? That one. So how in the F are we going to figure out what happened to him then? He doesn't show up anywhere else. What about other dude? What about John Davies? He got clubbed. He went clubbing. Ah. You got clubbed by this guy, really? Ah. Poor John. Ah, that sucks. Hmm. Yeah, by Idiot McGee, that's right. That's right. By this fucker right here. How is this guy, like, so good at not eating shit until the very end? Ugh. Really getting kind of annoyed at that guy. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute. He saw something, blah, 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 blah. You, you killed my brother or whatever. That was an accident. The ropes. The only fucking accident we got here is the very first one, right? I mean, besides the illnesses, right? So he might have been the one manning the ropes on lowering the cargo in the first chapter. Hmm. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's back out of here. We're gonna, we're gonna back out of the place we went specifically to ID a few folks. Go back to the very start. The start of this whole mess. The point where they just should have said, well, you know what? Somebody died just by loading this damn ship up. We should just cancel the entire thing. Bad luck. Is what it is. But no, they had to, they had to keep going Oops. and hope for the best. Well, guess what? The best did not happen. All right. Uh, actually, what the hell is through here? Is there anything through here? Oh. Oh. Oh, interesting. Did we? Uh... We didn't see this one yet. Huh. There was that's right, there was one blank page. Oof. Well, damn, yeah, double KO. <laughs> oh, shit. Oof. You know this guy? You know who this guy is? Yeah, Marcus Gibbs. We know him. He, uh... I wonder what happened to him. He got... I, I guess that'd be considered... Oh, wow. He, like, he took three fucking stabs. And he still had enough in him to just say, You will fuck you, boom! Alright. We can we can deal with this, I think. 
scimitar guy is coming in too. It's like, hey, uh, help you out. But all right, uh, yeah, I think we got enough. We got enough to ID this sucker. Yeah, the one that was empty. <laughs> Met an unknown fate? No, he got uh, speared, I guess. Bob Beast. Terrible beast. The initial, when you see a thing for the first time, it is timed, yeah. But then you can go back and invest a act all you want. Interesting. I knew there was a part of the ship I hadn't been before, so okay. Uh, do we know who this guy is? No. We do not know who this guy, that guy is. There's another one up there, too. Jeez. Alright, well... Uh, and the scimitar dude is up there too. Who was he again? He's the carpenter's mate. Well, we, we think he's the carpenter's mate. Ah, Tattoo Dude is coming in for some support here. Is this, I don't know, is this the same grate that other guy was trying to open? I don't think so. I think this is on the opposite end of the ship. Wait, is there somebody else behind the... There is, nice. Who's this dude? Oh, sneaky. Sneaky. Good! Good job, man. Doing the stealth moves. I don't know who he is, but I like him. He, he was using the old noggin. Don't know who he is, but uh, he did a good job. Hmm. I don't know if there's anything else to glean from this situation here, though. Unfortunate. But alright, okay, okay, okay. Let's, uh,. Go sort out the thing we were on our way to sort out <laughs> before we forget. Oof, nine kills in that chapter. That's not good. Nearly a sixth. Nearly a sixth of the entire ship ate it in that chapter. I thought this was the dude that got struck by lightning. I'm like, wait a minute, how did he survive an entire another part of this chapter? He did not. It was the wrong one. Care. Finish your business and climb down here. Well, I got a lot of business to take care of yet, buddy. Like we're 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 sticking around for a few more hours, so just like chill your nuts, alright? Jeez. Couldn't even lift a box with a book and a pocket watch in it. Don't be ragging at me to hurry up. Uh alright, we were originally on our way down here to look at the cargo, right? It was over here. I thought it was over here. No. No, that's where that guy broke his legs. There no there wasn't another thing down. Oh here, here, here. This one? Yeah, yeah, here we go. 
Is he the one on the... Ugh. Twelve others were present. Is our dude Lars Linda there? Yeah, he was. And that dude was saying something about, hey, you killed my brother. And he's like, no, no, man, it was the ropes. Well, the fucking rope snapped. They probably overloaded this. Like, that looks like a, a lot of cargo. Uh, I just wish I could I not get up there enough to actually ID these things. I don't think any of these dudes down here were Lars. I just want to climb up there. Or, like, tilt my head slightly further upward. And then that dude's there, too. Like, how the heck did he get up there? And how the heck am I seeing him? <laughs> oh, yeah, there he is. Good old Lars. There you are. I don't know how... He, well, I guess it was a pulley? Did he let go? Did it snap? I don't know. That's hard to, that's hard to see, and I hardly think he would be at fault for it. But, uh, I don't know. Maybe that guy should have looked up first. I think it's his fault. Um, hmm. But, uh, we know he's a brother to the other dude, that off poor Lars, so, uh, I think the only ones we had were the, what, the Peters brothers, right? Nathan and Samuel. There we go. <laughs> Just had to find the uh, the right combination there. And then Lars. Okay. I didn't lock in some of the other ones, which is unfortunate, but there's our first three of the night. But we did positively ID th two more, so good. Good, good, good. So now my next step is going to be going back to the... Um, whoever we ID'd as Martin, right? That was, what, the fourth mate? Third mate? Third mate. We don't know what happened to him. We know he was in a few things, right? We know John took something. Oh, right, because John got fucking clubbed in the face by, uh, oops. By what's his nuts, right? Yeah, every three, they give you that little interlude there and say, hey, congrats. Good job. You did it. I'm glad it's every three. <laughs> Like, it, like I'd, I'd love it if they said, you know, if you identified it, if you identified one to be like, yeah, hey, congrats, but that might be too easy to brute force in this entire thing. So I'm, gl I'm glad they give you a little bit to go on. Uh, all right, well, it looks like uh, John Davies was uh, in a lot of things here. So he ate it in Escape Part 5, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, ah, fuck you. 
Okay. Oh, let's see what we can do about that one. Where wait, where was that exactly? It's on the main deck. Yeah, everybody was on the main deck then. Off the port side in chapter four. Hmm. Okay, wait, wait. I'm gonna I'm gonna backtrack to this one here. Uh chapter six, part three. Hmm. Hmm. You know, let's go to chapter six, part three. I think I misidentified this guy. Because I think I read one of those transcripts wrong. Uh, but before I start changing this shit, let's go actually to the memory of it. Uh, so, gun deck? Right. Uh -huh. Main deck, whatever, port side, uh -huh. gun deck. Right below one of the things. Why did I identify him as Marcus? Did I have any backing to that? I might have just reversed these two, honestly. This might be Marcus and this might be Winston. Let's try that. Yeah. And then let's go actually examine this. Part 3, Chapter 6, Gun Deck. Hmm. Who was who here? No, okay. Well, that one we wanted to check anyway, so we're, we're close there. Oh, and this dude totally ate a bullet in the face, right? Yep. And we think this was, um... What's his nuts, right? Uh, good old Olus. We think he's the gunner's mate. We're just gonna go with that for now. Then go to. Uh, yeah, good. To investigate in the rain now. Uh. It's a bit further here. his story. Here, okay. Actually, this is good. This is where we wanted to be. We think he got speared by a beast. But that's probably not that's probably not true. Oh, maybe we thought Okay. I'm sorry, what's this we business? Maybe I thought this was considered a spear and not a spike. Uh so bonk. Um spiked by a terrible beast. And I think I'm gonna reverse these again. Uh this is Winston. And then 
this is Marcus. Because there's no way he dodged that, right? There's no way. Except, wait, what part of the thing are we on right now? Part three. I think we have, yeah, there. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. That, okay, that's why we said he was speared, right? Yeah, okay, yep, 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 yep. We think. Right? There wasn't anything that matched better. Poisoned? No. Eaten? No. <laughs> Executed, expired, exploded, fell, froze. Froze? Oof. Illness killed. Unknown alive. Axed. Axed. Burned, clawed, clubbed, crushed, decapitated, drowned. No. Speared seems the most accurate right now. Yeah, he was the one that died fighting that thing. These monster perish simultaneously with a brave but unfortunate soul. Yeah, 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 yeah. So are they angry? Are the mermaids like angry crabs when out of the water? Or are they different beings? I think they're different things. Um, I think it's riding one of the spiders. Because we've definitely seen the spiders on their own. And we've seen the, the riders on their own out in the sea. And then that was it. So let's see here. I, did I unreverse the names again? Or did I not do that? Okay. Let's reverse them one more time. My thought is that I had them reversed before because uh, this dude who ate it um, was saying, like, come on, boss, let's go kick their ass or something, and his boss is just like, no, man, no. <laughs> just don't. Don't do it. Um, but now I'm thinking this may, might not be right anyways. So my initial thought here, too, was that... Uh, back up. No, not this one. Uh... uh. Uh, here. No? No. One more back. Here. What's going on? Stay back. It's already done for Nick. See, when I read this the first time, I, I was thinking as you saying, like, oh yeah, stay back. Nick's already fucking done. If there was a comma here... Then it would make more sense as it's already done for Nick, whoever he's talking to, right? That's what I thought. But I might be wrong. But what we do know is that he survived this. Like, he must have dodged or something? Some weird ass matrix moves or what have you. Oh no, there's also this guy here. I didn't even see this guy here. Do we know who this guy is? We don't. Do we know who this guy is? Yeah, we know that's Samuel Peters. I thought this dude was Nathan Peters. Right? Because he was the one. He was the one accosting Lars, right? No. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This dude was the one accosting Lars. This is the dude who killed Lars. So that's got to be the other brother, right? So, Nathan Peters. Met an unknown fate. Like, who the fuck knows what happened to him? Um, he was in... 
He didn't eat it at all, did he? He got around, but he didn't eat it eventually, right? Here? Here. Here's where he... He beat the shit out of Lars. And we already know that's right, yeah? By Nathan Peters. By, uh... Yeah. That's interesting. So... Oh, damn it. So he was in do, 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 the Doom, right? Here. He was in this one. The Doom Part 1. And then he was also... Uh, where is he now? Oh, it doesn't show... Okay, so it doesn't show anything beyond that, yeah. Disappeared in the Doom. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. <sighs> hmm. Yeah, we don't know enough about him to say, like, hey, he fucking... Did he survive? Did he... Did he do something... All right. Um, man, we're so close on these two here. I don't know why I thought they were the carpenter dudes. Maybe there was some... Let me see where else he was. Of course, he's on the main deck for that. Moira. Wait. It's on the main deck for that. Okay. Uh, I don't, I don't want to know where the corpse was there. I want to know where um, what's his nuts was. Ate it there, there, and he was here. What was he doing there? <sighs> what was he doing there? Okay, well, what about the other dude? Not Winston. What about Marcus? Do we, well, this may not even be Marcus. I swear I saw one of them in the carpenter shop, which is why I put them down as carpenters, but maybe I didn't. Who did we see? Or when did we see them? Was that when they were slaughtering the cow? Hmm. Let's go back. Let's, uh, let's put a pin, or a spike, <laughs> in this one. And, uh, and we'll come back. 
that's not the way out. Uh, how do we get out of here? Where's the door? Where's the door? There it is. Why is the door all the way up here? Oh, I see. That's definitely a spear. Yeah, okay. Alright, let's, um... I swear I saw somebody in the carpenter's area. I think it was when they were slaughtering the thing. Stone of rain. I'll cut her throat when you've done it. Here? Yeah. Come on before she kicks off. <laughs> okay, wait. This is one deck below the carpenter system. Charlie, did we ID Charlie already? He's the one tossed his cookies. Find your shoes now. He was already locked in. Yep, yeah, okay. Alright, this is not the right one then. It was one of the ones earlier. Was it one of the sickness ones? Yeah, it must have been one of the sickness ones. Oh, it wasn't a mermaid riding those things, huh? It, it looked, that's what it looked like to me, but maybe you're right. And this, oh yeah, here's one of, this is John Davies, right? Or Martin, Martin, Martin's here. We already, yeah, we already got the surgeon and surgeon's mate going. Yeah, That's too far away from the uh, carpenter shop anyways. Surgeons here. Yeah, carpenter shop is at the other side. Damn it! I swear I saw something over there. Would have been before shit started going down. Or maybe it was during the moita. Might have been during the moita. All right. Moida most foul. Uh, this is one. This is one deck too high. I think, right? Then over. Where the heck are we? Right here. Oh, right. Uh, pretty much just do a 180. Certain carpenter shop is on the other side of the ship. Okay. Right here. Hmm, so who died closest to here where we can get a good look at who was in there? Moida, 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 Moida. Oh, that's where his corpse is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Who else was there? Oh, it's just those two. Those two, right, and Nichols. 
What a ding dong. All right. Uh, that's not the one I'm thinking of. It's the main deck. Also on the main deck. This this I don't think is right. So we're gonna undo that one for now. And neither of our two carpenter hopefuls are in this picture anyways, so mm. Hmm. Wouldn't have been chapter four. go get somewhere chapter five all right chapter five was kind of a little lull between all the garbage that was going on yeah uh this one uh deck three <laughs> right near the carpenter shop okay yeah so we are literally right here this is good um Right here. Yeah, there we go. That's why. That's why I think they're the carpenters. Because they are! Because <laughs> they are the carpenters. They were literally right in here. Alright. Now, question is... Which one is the carpenter, and which one's the carpenter's mate? Pretty sure we got it right. Like, this is... I think this is the carpenter's mate here. Well, no. No, maybe that's... maybe that's the other way around, actually, because... This dude survived, right? He's like, fucking... Boss, get down, boss, get down. And then this dude in here was just like, no, nah, fuck it, I'm going out, I'm getting me a kill. So I'm going to reverse these one more time. Uh, here. And then, uh, here. I feel like that would have popped another another three solved if that was right though. Maybe not. Maybe we don't have a third. Oh, we don't know that this dude is right anyways, right? Not letting me change it though. It's weird. This is yeah, that's not right. I don't know. Who the hell is Charles Miner? I am Charles Miner. That was the whole Frenchman thing, right? No idea. No idea. Hmm. Maybe we don't have another one. I thought we had one more marked that would have kicked off right there, but maybe not. Hmm. You know, if we've got the carpenters right, 
Maybe we just brute force this one. Because let's see, what's what's what does Dude Face McGee look like here? He's he didn't look maybe any higher than a midshipman, I would say. And I think we've already got those two identified. So maybe he's a topman? isn't going as well as I would hope. <laughs> Definitely not O'Hagan, because O'Hagan was out in the boats and Dipshit McGee was not out in the boats. Henry Brennan. We've ID'd Henry Brennan. <laughs> okay, we know we know who he is. <laughs> So wait a minute, how the heck is that, how would that have equated to Henry Brennan? How would we have gotten to that otherwise? Uh, let's go back. Or forward, rather. That would have been, uh, one deck up? No. Down here, and in whatever the gallery was beyond, right? Or other side. I don't get that why that's who that was. Like, I don't understand. Maybe it'll be... Maybe it'll become clear. Where the fuck was that now? Maybe it was one more deck up. Oh yeah, here we go, here we go. Hit the Google has a red type return on an auto suggested. Right? Right? Yeah. Okay, so that's alright. Obviously that's not the one we're looking for. Um it's the next one. Or the other the other corpse. The one that uh or no. No, this was much later during the escape. Alright, as much as I want to hear that blast again. There we go. That's not what the one I wanted to look at. Uh, which one? Which one was it? This one. Henry Brennan is our dingleberry here. I don't necessarily understand, but I guess we'll just go with it. But alright, so we're pretty confident with that. Because wasn't there somebody yelling, like, Brennan, get the surgeon's kit or something before? I feel like that was a thing. Man, 17 memories. It's around. I feel like that was a thing.
it was part of the previous one too? Interesting. Realize that. Yeah, he's the one about to to eat sh well, he's not the one that ate shit there. He was the one scared of getting his shit pushed in there. Uh then he ate it there, right? Oh right, because technically he was um wait. Or two. I guess technically he did die in part two, even though we heard his death gurgle in part three. Mm. Part six. Oh, here. I think it was here, right? Part six. Yeah, Brennan, bring the surgeon's kit. Like, what? Then this dude who just died. Something about Pete and pulling back, right? So what else we got here? Uh, he was the he was the one that did this, right? And then he was crawling here. He's crawling away because he got stabbed by the dude who was reporting mutiny. Or no, was he? I don't, I don't, I don't know. Um, apparently he was there and there and there. Where was he trying to pull somebody back? Pulling back this one here? Do they get crushed by a cannon? Hmm. That might be a little bit beyond our reach for now. <laughs> get it beyond our reach because he was trying to pull somebody back. No, forget it. Um, all right. So that's probably no good. Uh... Although I guess it would make sense, because this, this was the dude trying to surprise the cat from behind. Really, really late. Brandon was part of the mutiny. Uh... Hoska was part of the mutiny. And this, I don't know, what was this dude's deal? He got stabbed in the back. But why, why, why would he have been involved? There? One of these. He was crawling, yeah, he was crawling away here. I don't know if that's right. All right, let's, let's have a look around. Okay, yeah. Uh. Okay, let's duck out of this one. Let's duck to the part before this. Other dude gets his face rearranged and or removed. Here. Oh, he already got stabbed in that one. Catch any of that text before that? Yeah. Okay, it can't be trusted. Yeah, it's a sale. East trade, retrofishing sales for gold. 
Blah, 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 blah. Mutiny, mutiny, fresh bastard. No. Gets his face taken off. By, you know, this dude. Mutiny! Mutiny! I think this is right after dude was asking for his Frenchie, so let's go back one more. Right? I mean, it is kind of hard to tell. Like, there's a lot of faces getting rearranged here. But eventually, we'll pull it all together. Do we know that that's what happened? Okay. So... We know. We know that our uh, Austrian's mate is from France, right? Like, that's pretty clear. That's pretty clear, isn't it? Your mate was torn apart, right? So we know that... And what, what's this dude? Is, is the Bosun. Okay, so Bosun's mate is French. That has to be Charles Minor, right? We know this. That's written down. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. We just don't know who he is, right? That's the whole deal? But we know he was torn apart. By the beast. Or by the squid. Squid? Squid. Probably squid. So... going on here. Camp is coming up from the hold. But whatever. We'll, we'll, we'll take care of that later. It's fine. Hmm. So let's look at some of the... Wait, which one was this? Which one was this? This is Moida. Why was this the Moida one? Oof. Right. Why though? Why though? Okay, this is where they were, um... Oh, right. So they were just starting the mutant. Yeah? Or this was part of Nichols' whole thing, right? To go take the boats and, and do whatever. Is this Nichols, right? Yeah, what a piece of shit. Um, okay. Where the heck are we even in this timeline? Main deck. Is this, it looks like Lars. What is Lars? What's Lars doing up here? And oof, he got a spear right in the leg. But he didn't die here, so. What happened? What happened with this guy? What's his deal? Oh, he disappeared. I don't know why he disappeared. Disappeared here. Hmm. He was there, and he disappeared in the Doom Part 8.
an empty page here? Or is this, this page intentionally left blank? Hmm. Yeah, that's a... Uh, that's a hell of a strike. That is in deep. That is in deep. Definitely gonna need a cane. Oh, he can just use the thing in his leg. Okay, well, I was just curious about that one, but that's not where we were, where we were headed. The captain's wife's memory? No, that wasn't... Was that one that one was? Actually, maybe you're right. You're right. Yeah, there he is. That unknown fate. Okay, well, since we're pretty close to that, well, let's go take a look. Let's go take a look. Uh, let's access through her corpse, right? This guy somehow survived to get his face blown off, so good job. It's not Finley. Where's Finley? Where is Finley in this gigantic fuck mess here? Excuse me. I would like to. No. Okay. How about this stairway? Can I go up this stairway? No. Just come on. Yeah, I don't know that Finley's in here. Where would he? Have, where would he have been? Like, how could he have ever been up here? No way. Or is it just that he disappeared somewhere in this chapter, not necessarily this part? Is that what I was saying? Disappeared during the events of this chapter. Okay, yeah. Which wasn't, like, wasn't there, like, two parts? Part eight. Oh, good lord. Gravy. All right. Uh, hmm. Near the captain's cabin? I think you saw him. Really? Oh yeah. Look at that. Wow. Unfucking lucky. Like, he's holding on. Good on him. But so, given that he's mostly intact here. Probably drowned by a beast, right? Or he disappeared or something. But there's no way he, he took that fucking. Looked like a spear. Took that spear to the fucking thigh. And then there's no way he's hanging on here. Like, absolutely no way. This is the last part of that chapter, yeah? Yeah. Oh yeah, that is on his injured leg. Oof, ouch. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Uh, yeah, there's no way he survives that. But there's nothing, like, vaguer than drowning we can do for this. Eaten? Eaten?
torn apart? He's not the one missing the leg, though. No, um, the Austrian, Alfred. Alfred was the one missing the leg. So he definitely disappeared. But, I, like, Eaton seems a bit too specific. Go drowned. are wrong. I don't even know if these are the right people. Oh, Hawksfing Law. We know what happened to him. Uh, what's his nut shot him? Brennan. He was the only one that had aim. Henry Brennan? No. Yeah. Yeah, Henry Brennan, right? Yeah, there we go. Bwomp. Okay, drowned. Very good. <laughs> and then he ate shit finally. Eat shit, Henry Brennan! I mean, yeah, I guess he did get two kills, huh? Like, one of them he had to earn, the other one was just literally just swaying there, so... <laughs> I don't know if he earned that one. One and a half, at best. Like, I'll, I'll give him one and a half. He doesn't get full credit for that first one, though. Even if he was the only one that actually hit. Um, but -dip, but -dip, but -dip, but -dip, but -dip. okay. Did those... I wasn't paying full attention. Did those lock in the ones we thought they were going to lock in? Glad we got that one. Um, but what else do we kind of have outstanding here? The two ladies, of course. Olus, we don't know. Right. Olus was the one that got his face rearranged. We think. Uh, carpenters were locked in in the previous three. Yep, yep, yep. It's this guy. It's got to be this guy, right? Yeah. This is the only... That's the only Formosan left, I think. The, for the other Formosan guard was Chiotan. So we're pretty confident with this one. Although I might just want to confirm that he was indeed spiked and not speared, because that's kind of that's kind of a toss-up depending on what killed him. So let's see. That was, was, was uh, chapter five. Top deck. Okay, so I think we're done with this one for the time being. Good eye on uh, seeing old Finley hanging on for dear life there. Let's see. What's top deck, right? That guy? Or this guy? Definitely not that guy. That guy is electrocuted, right? We think. Yeah. What is this guy's story? Yeah. He was definitely a topman, right? So he was up on the rigging. I think that, that that's probably pretty close. That's close enough to to get to make him a topman. 
Hey Tormod, how you doing? Good to see you. Thanks for the Thanks for the resub. Much appreciate, much appreciate. You've caught us in our uh, insurance investigation mode here. Figuring out some uh, what terrible fates have befallen these people. Um All right, what were we doing? We were trying to find uh, what's his nuts. I think one of these two, yeah. Oh yeah, that's definitely that's definitely a spear <laughs> or an, a spike rather. Yes, yes, it is my birthday today. So thank you for the happy birthday. It's not. I mean, it's not public knowledge. It's not private knowledge. It's just kind of knowledge. <laughs> Just kind of knowledge that's hanging out there. Um, let's see here. Did we consider this a double kill here? Because that looks like that's got to be a through and through, right? Like, oof, he's done. Or is this the other dude that ate it in this chapter? Yeah, yeah, it is. Okay. And then this dude is, uh, yeah, he definitely got, that's definitely a spike, that's not a spear. Get on out of here. Oh, that's right, Cap almost got kneecapped there, but, uh, good thing he's got a nice wide stance. <laughs> Sorry? Okay. Um. <laughs> oh, Johnny's jail. <laughs> uh, uh. Good lord. Um, that dude we already know. Okay, yeah, there's the surgeon and the surgeon's mate. Those are the three from... Yeah, those are the three from out on the sea. Oh, they're hauling one of them in from the boats. Oh, interesting. Not a great idea. Has it got a nice double kill? Um, hmm. I guess I just really wanted to confirm if it was a spike or a spear, so we're good there. I don't think we're going to be able to ID anybody else. Eh, unless... Hmm... Nah. Oh, yeah, you're right. Was this the dude that finessed Nichols on his way back in? Like, if so, props, give him a medal. Um, but, oh, man, it's a bad way to go for doing a public service, you know? Um, I think you might be right, though, huh? Let's see. See what else he's got. Uh, there, you stand in guard there. He was standing guard during the illness thing. Yeah, he's definitely present there. Yeah, yeah, I think you're right. He's like, ah, oh, fuck, I'm coming back. I'm an idiot. I'm the only one out of eight that survived. Please take me back. And he's like, no, man, fuck you, kaboom. Uh, yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Wait, did we already, um, oh, a second. Did we already identify Nichols? Or fully identify Nichols' thing there? Uh... Yeah, yeah, we did. Okay. Yep, that would have been a positive ID regardless. Okay, good. Good, good. Good, good, good. Yeah, he, he probably knew that his other guard friend got framed. And he knew Nichols took um, the two royals out in the boat as well. Uh, Miss Lim and uh, Bang. It Bang Xia. Unlan Lim and it bangs ya. 
and then they died out there. And then he's like, well, fuck the dude that took him out there and just took matters into his own hands. And, well, you know, law of the ocean, I guess. Eat shit, Nichols. You deserve it. Uh, all right. Hmm. God, of course it's gonna come down to, like, all these generic-ass mofos down here. Like, the top officers, easy to ID. They wear the fancy shit. They get themselves into trouble. Even most of the passengers are like, okay, they're they're I they're ideable. But then like some of the normal ass crew is just like, well, who the fuck is who? Who is who? Alright. Well, I just wanted to come back to this one to, to confirm that. Oh right, then this guy is just like doing a doing his little shimmy sham and avoided taking one in the hip. So good for him, but he ate it at some point, right? Oh, that was Alfred. Oh, poor Alfred, actually. He probably didn't need to eat it. He probably didn't deserve to eat it. Him and his Frenchman did not deserve to eat it. <laughs> Did the goat avoid it, too? Yeah, look at that. Well, I mean... I suppose... Caught the goat's cage, but yeah. I, oh, well, I did get in there, huh? Bleh. Is that what a goat sounds like? Uh, Alright, well, I think we're probably done here. I need those two. Cap, of course. Jotan, of course. Uh, what's this dude's story? We don't know who he is. Everybody else is kind of doing their thing. I think they're just trying to get that back on the ship, probably, huh? What's the dude behind him? Eh, there we go. Yeah, they don't really have any idea who those folks are. What about the rest of you? Oh, is that Lars? What was he? He was just a normal seaman. Eh, <laughs> seaman. Uh, oh, and this was, uh, what, Nathan Peters? Yeah. Pretty sure this dude was a, a seaman as well, right? If they're working the, the giganto wheel there, I think they're all seamen. He was crushed by oh right, he was crushed by a cannon. Womp. Bad bad luck for him. Alright. Yeah, I think we're done here. Are there any other easy ones we can ID? Oh, who was the... Where was that one? Where was the topman that got struck by lightning? Oh, right, we were trying to find Charles, which seems like it's not Tattoo Dude. We were trying to find Charles, he was torn apart. And they were talking about it below decks, but, uh, would have been, what, Chapter 7, right? Let's start with, yeah, so let's just start at the scene of the crime, right? Yeah, that's not good. <laughs> that ain't good. Look away. Be 
know this guy. We don't. No, he's a midshipman, maybe. Just because he's dressed all... Dressed all fancy-like. Yeah, the rifle toss is kind of weird, huh? Like, why would you think? Why would you think, one, that she'll make that toss, and two, that he's gonna catch it? Dude's story. Oh, right. He got exploded. Bad luck. I think. Did he get exploded? We just kind of assumed he got exploded. Right? That's definitely exploded. Definitely exploded. Alright. Throw the powder, kaboom. Okay. Boom. Yeah, that's an explosion. Um. Huh. Oh, that's right. He tried to carry all those guns. Bad idea. By the way, don't try to carry all those guns. You know what happened to him yet? Yeah, he got clubbed. You know what happened to him? Yeah, he got his face shot off, right? By him, in fact. No, no, by somebody else. There's Tattoo Guy, he's about to have a very bad day. that is. Hmm. What section of this chapter is this? Part six. Okay. No, 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 not to... Okay, yep, we know that that was happening, they were trying to get the fuck out. Good for them, good idea. Poor Lars, took it in the face. Right. Edward Spratt, unfortunately. He's just trying to hide out, draw his pictures, didn't make it out. Uh, crushed by a loose cannon. Okay, so that was below decks. That's right. Christian took it in the face from a cannon. Ouch. But probably one of the better ways to go, honestly. How heavy were those cannonballs, do you think? If you took a full blast of that right in the face, I doubt you'd feel it. I think you would be gone before you felt nothing, so... Not a bad way to go in the grand scheme of, uh, of this timeline here. And this guy, how did, how did they die? That's a good question. All right, let's let's go below decks here. Got one that says, "Oh, how the, how the fuck did he die?" Even though it's clear that he died, and he was down there somewhere, right? Okay, six pound or twelve pound, huh? All right, so average it out. Bowling ball. You take a bowling ball. Cast iron bowling ball, right? Flying at speed. After who knows how much you know, black powder or whatever. Yeah, that's that's gonna spell one the end of your days and two probably relatively painless. Uh, so what what's the unknown death here? Was it this one? Nope, that was the blast in the face. Okay, very good. And that one's crushed by, well... Loose cannon, I guess? Yeah, loose cannon. Where's the unknown one, though? Oh, 
man, see, if Brennan was gonna eat shit, why didn't he eat shit right here? Would've saved, like, two people. Well, no, one person. Rooting for the squid on that one. Where the heck was the second? Yeah, there was that, but... There's nothing else around here, huh? Nice firm hug there, too. Is this the second dude? There's the second one to this. Part three, so not the one. This one. This one? Yeah, that one. literally get crushed under that cannon. No. Where's that other one? Where the f He wasn't the one that got crushed in the neck, was it? it wasn't this one. No, that's all the way back there. This one? No. Also, th this was the neck crush cannon, dude. Okay. This one? No. Man. All y'all gotta die in unique ways. This is getting confusing. Alright, there's artist dude, right? Wasn't him. Crushed by falling cargo. Yeah, right, they were hauling something down. Eleven, about 1,200 pounds for the two. The carriage is only 405 pounds. Jeez. So, like, 15 to 1,600 pounds of stuff. Man, yeah, that would, uh... Definitely put you in a bad way. This dude, too. He didn't have hair. Did I just overlook it because I'm an idiot? So there was that one, and it wasn't this dude, right? No, that was the other dude that got crushed. Was this dude's corpse? It was part four? That guy. Or did they both eat? Did... Are there two people here? Or just the one? Or just the one Sir Topham hat that lost his hat? Where was the second one? Not that guy. That's the third one. Where's the second one? This one? No. Not that one. Not that one. Not that one. Those three are still alive and kicking for now. What the heck was the... It's not up above, because we can't go up there. Alright, shout it out if you see him, because uh, I'm not seeing him.
No, that's Sir Topham Hat here. I lost his hat. Eat by the gun. No, that's the other dude. That's that's Beardo. I'm looking for uh I'm looking for this guy. The other gun? The other other gun. Oh this guy. No, he's still alive. For now. That's not him. Do we know who he is? No, we don't. <laughs> the other gun. <laughs> Okay, uh, not either of those sides. Gun there, gun there, that guy ate that gun. Not that guy, not that guy. Sir, excuse me. Coming through. Uh, that's the same guy. Yep, nope. Like here? Think he got pushed out? I can't get any... Like, I wouldn't count out vaporization, but I don't think that's one of our causes of death we can select. I don't think the East India Company will be too happy with us if we return this book and say, Well, he gone. Not that guy, right? No. Although six others were present. One of the... Yeah, it's this guy. What do you mean six others were present? Oh, because it's the next one after. Weird. Four others were present. Yeah, so he definitely died somewhere. That's why I hit this bar in the first place. <laughs> East India Company is no longer a thing, right? We can openly mock them. Well, I think it's too late. We, we, we'll openly mock them regardless. Alright, well... Alright, so one, two, three, four. This guy apparently died in the previous part, right? Because Sir Topham Hat is in the current part. I mean, if we follow the whole vaporization angle, right? Like, he's blasted with a cannon by a terrible beast. So, double kill for a squid. Good, good for them. Doing the good work here. But, it, like, if you're right on that, I guess he was very close to that spot, yeah? Wouldn't have doubt it. Wouldn't have doubt it. So there's him. He gets crushed right there. Yeah, he is, like, right behind him. So it's entirely likely he got pulled out the window. In the next scene. So I feel like if we... Oh, well... I feel like if he got blasted by the cannon, we would have seen maybe 20% of his body, at the very least, right? <laughs> it died off screen. Oh, yuck. <laughs> I don't know. I think he, yeah, I, I, I think the squid got him. That's, uh, I think that's a reasonable presumption on our part. But let's go back one more time and just do our dang just to find him. So it would be, uh, yeah, because there was no, like, there's no corpse present. Well, I 
guess the cannon would have done all that damage, huh? Ugh. Oh, right, because they had another cannon in this... One of the passenger cabins. Like, good thinking, whoever did that, but, uh... Probably not extremely effective. Alright, one more peek. One more peek here. Like that, that first little bit, that first splorch, sounds like other dude getting pulled out. <laughs> Which, if that's the case, actually, we see, oh no, they don't let me go in here. And then this dude starts yelling, Oh, the fuse! And kaboom. Doesn't have to worry about nothing no more. So yeah, I'm thinking he got pulled out. So if that's the case, what would that... What would that qualify as, do you think, huh? That qualify as a drowned? Or as a torn apart? Sounded like a torn apart. And could this have been, well, let's see here. We were looking for another torn apart, actually. So this might have been, what's his nuts? Uh, Bosun's mate, uh, Charles Minor. Maybe even Eaton, yeah. I mean, that's that's a strong possibility too, yeah. I don't know. I guess I just I can't identify torn apart versus Eaton just by ear when a giant squid is involved. Like that's that's not one of my skills. But I I would agree that it could be either. I don't know that that's Charles Minor, honestly. The fact that we don't have any semblance of a corpse here... ...leads me to believe that they don't want torn apart, they want drowned. But, it's also not a disappearance, so... I don't know. You know, I, I think to, to square this away, we're gonna have to hear that one more time. still, like, really, uh, unclear. It wasn't... It didn't feel sudden enough to be eaten, I don't think. Like, if it was, like, a chomp-chomp type thing, you, you would have think, like, a hard cut. Hard cut off a of voice there. The, the fact that there was, like, a little... At the end. That signals to me torn apart. So I think we'll go with that for now. But, you know, just to be sure, just to be sure. Yeah. 
man. That was kind of a hard cut there, wasn't it? It wasn't like a long, prolonged death rattle. Hmm. I don't know. Like, it's almost like we can only... Can't quite see like beyond. If you just let me open this door, <laughs> so I can look out that window, we can be sure. But damn it! I just don't know. I'm gonna leave it at Torn Apart for now. Just trying to make out the outline of a corpse there, but there's nothing. There's nothing. Alright, let's look at uh, the scene before this. Where was he? Where was he in relation to everything else? Who's behind? Is behind. <laughs> Although, okay. Well, that all right. So that little splorch thing was probably this guy, since this is the dude who died in this scene, right? Probably. So is that a different splorch from the next one? Or is that the same? You know what? We're gonna, we're gonna figure this out. We gotta figure this out. It's our job to figure this out. It was a different splorch. Because there's that, there that first little, like, muffled crunching, which I believe was the dude getting crushed by the cannon, and then there was the blah 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 blah, and then I think that was the dude getting pulled out the window, and then of course the dude getting the cannonball in the face. Hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. There no there's no crouch button, huh? There's no crouch button, there's no sprint button, there's no stick your head out the window button. Can't quite. Is there a way to. Can we go above decks? No. We're dead center in the middle of the ship, they don't let us go above decks, of course. Oh, unless. Ah, uh, no. Alright, see you later, Cave. Thanks for stopping by. Catch you another time. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I think that's the best we got. There's no way we can identify him. Like, he's a, he's a three-triangle mofo, so we ain't deducing that anytime soon. But, uh, well, I think we've... Pulled as much info out of this grisly scene as we can, so let's just back the fuck out of there. See if there's any little little spot of them left on the side of the ship here, or or not? Doesn't appear so, huh?
Hmm. Well, okay. So, yeah, it's getting kind of late. So we'll probably wrap this here. But will they... If I leave, quote-unquote, what's it going to do? Will that unlock the other chapter thing I'm about? All done. No. We should go. Not all done, Storm's but... Storm's nearly about, so we won't be coming back. If you have still business here, climb up and finish it. Else I'll make to port. Oh. No, I don't want to leave, then. That sounds pretty final. Doesn't it? Sounds pretty final. <laughs> so we're not gonna... We're not gonna do that. Hate to have that happen and lose all our work. So okay, well we'll 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 pause it there then. That's fine. Whew! Okay, so what we did we identify another six there? Where's that nine? I think that was at least six, right? What did we start with? We started with fifteen. So that was another nine. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that's real good. That's real good. Well, I think that was probably all the easy ones, though, so the the remainder are going to be more difficult. But the remainder will also be left for next time, so uh, we'll call it there. Next stream will be tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m. CST Shmup Book Club. Uh, Parsec 47 or... Uh, what call this the monthly? What's the other Shmup we're playing? Uh... I can see it in my head. I can see it in my mind's eye, but I can't identify what it is. Oh, Gyrus. Gyrus. That's what it was. Um, so, Parsec 47 or Gyrus tomorrow. First Muppet Club, 7.30 p.m. CST. Uh, Saturday, Quest and Rock p.m. CST. Probably early afternoon sometime. Be grab bag. We'll pick out something cool and fun and neat. Because there wouldn't be any point if it wasn't cool or fun or neat. Or all three. Uh, then Sunday, 7 p.m. CST. Sunday long play. We're just gonna commit to Noida right now. We'll, we'll just say, yeah, let's play some more Noida and, and, and hope for the best. Um, that'll do it for the week. But that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.